Right now, you know, things are just so weird in the world. And I just think what we all need is a bit of joy. And I, I, I do know that's what Vivid does bring to Sydney, great joy. And family, it's a family thing, you know, you can take the kids and you know, it's important. I'm launching my new gospel album in a world premiere at Vivid Sydney from the illuminating surrounds of Sydney's magnificent St. Stephen's Uniting Church. When I think of gospel music, I, I think it's religious, but I think it's also a feeling that you get, a warm feeling that you get. Most black kids in America do grow up in church. My godmother was the head of her church. She was blind, and because she was blind, I was allowed to go into the choral box and sit with her. Children weren't allowed, but because she was my godmother and she was blind, I'd lead her there and sit there and listen to all the ladies sing. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, and she was very, very integral in my, my, musical, my musical career. I've recorded many albums, but this is the first time, and some of my albums have got spiritual songs sprinkled through them, but to do a whole album of, of, of spiritual, I'm, I'm stoked. You know, premiering an album such as this for Vivid Sydney makes me feel very proud, you know, and, and I hope that people come and have a bit of a listen. This is a great city, and um, it's one of the prettiest cities in the world, and seeing it lit up and seeing people's faces smile, that's all we live for.